is going on guys? We are on a deep sea fishing adventure. You guys have been asking this for a long time and we are finally doing it. We are on Hawaii. I am with my dad and we're with Chuck who is a local lifeguard, grew up here in Hawaii and then Donovan is the captain. Chuck is gonna be the skipper today, and Donovan is the captain. And guys, check it out. We have a full, full moon right behind us. It is dawn. Let's get fishing. I would like to thank my dad for putting this trip together. Oh yeah. You always put together the best trips <laughs> for us. Couldn't do it without Donovan and Chuck, so. Yeah, that's Just a bunch of big squid, big gnarly hooks right there. Amazing. What pound liter is that? 300. 300 pound test one. That's what you want to hear. What do I do here? Guys. Guys, guys, just a few minutes in, like literally a few minutes in, we have a bite. I think this one came off too. What? Wait, he might be swimming toward us. Came off or what? I don't know if he's swimming toward us or if he came off. I think he came off. No, he's no, still he's there. On. He's on, he's on. He's he was just swimming straight for us. Yeah, he's swimming right there. Yeah, that's right. Leader. Okay, stop. Step back. 
chuck. Grab the gas bag. Grab the gas yep. chuck. Yep. Woo! Oh. Woo! Woohoo! Another one. Light bar. Okay. Yep. Nice. <laughs> Yep. Alright. Okay, flip that little latch. Woo! Wow! Nice! <laughs> I know, isn't that gorgeous? The deep blue water, and we're we're close to shore, guys. We're at 200, well, we're at 44 fathoms, which should be around 250 feet of water. 250 feet of water this close yeah. to shore. Alright guys, they are now reeling in the lines because they're going to switch up some lures and we're headed out to a buoy way out at sea now we've done we're done fishing around the island and head out to a buoy and fish for some tuna and mahi mahi around there just a little lure change just putting on something smaller a little bit uh these ones are fiberglass heads i make seducer lures um now we're going for mahi and ahi sweet these are for the onos are chrome heads Tangling. Yep. All of them. Guys, we got one. Wait a second. Oh, might have came off. Damn. I think it was a fire. I'm going to go forward. Well, guys, we lost the fish. Uh, uh, Donovan and Chuck said it was probably a marlin. So, yeah. So, well, that's the way it goes. Didn't have the right hook. That's oh, what he, said. He, didn't have uh, he said he didn't have a marlin hook. We have it out for mahi and tuna, so that's probably why it got off. Big 
reel right here with lead fishing line and that keeps the low in the water the lure low in the water and then you can have up high the regular fishing rods so that's why we can have five lines out at once i think it's that's so oh look, look oh we got one we got one pop pop you yeah a crazy uh, coincidence sitting there explaining the reel guys check this out it's like a great big rattle trap I mean huge rattle trap you say the hookup ratio isn't very good on this one Chuck nah. it's, it's been hit twice but we it's gotten off both times you gonna switch it out he's gonna switch out the rattle trap for that beauty right there that is so cool. I love this. This is a blast. So to all the bass fishermen out there, you know when you're feeling bad to the bone using that big one ounce rattle trap, catching the big bass, try a one pound rattle trap. That's... You'll be good. Okay. Guys, we got something small. Did you say something small, Chuck? I think so. I think it took it from you. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. Something hit it so hard, guys, it turned the bait around. That's crazy. Woo! We got one, boys. Good. Great. Get on it. Get on it. It's about halfway in, Pops. You're doing great. <laughs> I know it's hard. It's way harder than it looks, isn't it? Oh, yeah, because you're left hand. Oh, yeah. Keep going. You all right? Yeah, I can see leader pops. Leader. Just a few more feet. Just a few oh, more feet. Like yes, sir. I'll open up the cooler. All right. Come around this point out here. It's really good spot. Guys, we're on again. Got another bite. We're on. Got him. Oh, nice. Look at that beautiful fish. Oh my gosh. Let him settle down a second. Nice. That's three species on the day. Species on the day. We missed the marlin. Yeah, we missed a marlin. Here we are in the back. That is so beautiful. What a sight. Home again, home again. Back in the harbor. That is amazing. Yep. What is the most Ono you guys have ever caught in a day, or like highest number of Ono? Uh, my best day was on the Big Island, and um, I'm not the sure. You done. I'm not exactly sure how many we got, but we got probably 30 or 40 of them. Wow! I got the deal. Go ahead. I'm gonna slice this yep. way so yep. just yeah, stand back. Mm. 
beautiful big mm. steaks and oh no. Wow. Is that a good good eating fish too, that tuna? Yeah. The local guys like that one because it's they like the fishy tasting fish. Gotcha. They don't like mahi mahi because it's more mainland style fish, yeah. They like the real fishy taste. They eat fish for the fish taste. Right, right. Yeah. That's so cool. And then guys, we're gonna take this little guy home and these make fantastic bait. We'll probably sample him too. We'll probably, probably try tasting him, but we're gonna take him home and this, the flesh of this fish is really oily and we're gonna try him in a bait, so stay tuned, uh, try him as bait. So stay tuned for that episode. Donovan, thank you so much. Like your rides here, buddy. I appreciate Good it. Day. Hey, I'll tell, I'll text you guys when the video's up. Chuck, sure. thank you so much. Okay, thank you. And have a good day. Yeah, let us know. I want to watch it. Yes, I will. Guys, what a day. What a fabulous day of fishing. That is the best day of trolling I've ever had. I've gone out trolling like that several times and just, we haven't had much luck. In fact, last time we went out, we caught zero fish in like a nine hour trip. So to go out and catch that many fish was just amazing. Now, we gotta cook some up. So I came out here on the roof of our condo because they have this sweet little party spot right up here and nobody's up here right now. Check out that view. Amazing. And right over here, we have grills. And then right over here, we have this sweet little kitchen spot where we can prepare the fish. I'm gonna prepare both of these fillets by cooking them in foil on the grill. This is the Ono, and then the thin piece is the Mahi Mahi. I've actually put each fillet in its own like little boat here so that uh, we don't you know, mix the flavors. We can taste each fish how it's gonna be. We're gonna put some butter, real butter, whipped butter, right on there. Then douse some little olive oil. Then some rosemary. Then salt. Minced garlic. And finally some basil leaf crumbles. That should do it for now. Oh wait, I almost forgot. The most important part, one of the most important parts, some lemon over this. Good amount on each fish. Put some lemon slices in there as well. And look at that guys, we got some beautiful fish. Now let's make this up into a little boat. Make sure we seal it up good to get seal in all the flavors. To a flaming grill, we will add both of the fish and close that tight. And now we wait. While the fish cooks, let's do a little giveaway here. Guys, you see my necklace that I wear in almost every single one of my videos? Well, they have them here in Hawaii. And I cannot find these online. So, I bought an extra one, and I will send this to you guys personally. All you have to do to enter the giveaway is share this video somewhere with someone, and then put a comment down below. And I will pick somebody randomly from the comment section. There is no sign up, there's no, hey, click here, and then give me your email and phone number and social security number and everything else. None of that. All you have to do is share the video and leave a comment down below. Randomly pick someone, even if this is like, your first, you're like, you don't even know anything about me, it's your first time watching a video. Comment down below if you want this sweet necklace. I love it. So many necklaces that they sell tourists here in Hawaii, they come apart really easily. I've had the same one for forever. So anyway, comment down below if you guys want a necklace and share the video and you will be entered into the giveaway. All right, let's check this out. Oh. Is it done? Oh man, guys, I cannot, I wish I could transmit smell through the camera. I cannot. This smells amazing. And the fish is cooked through. Oh, guys, look at that. Say a quick prayer for this amazing blessed day. So many cool things. Guys, we didn't even, 
I didn't have the camera out for this one part. We saw pilot whales, didn't even know that was a thing. We saw dolphins, flying fish, just so many beautiful animals out there. And of course, all the fish that we caught. All right, here we go. I'm gonna try the Ono first, or the Wahoo. Wahoo! How did they come up with that name, Wahoo? Here we go. Mm. Guys, the fish is so good. And then that combination of spices on it. I think I'm getting, I can honestly say this, I think I'm getting better and better at cooking. All right, so if I can take a moment to brag on myself here, look at even how good that looks. That, the, the with the, the color combination of spices right there, Let's try the mahi mahi. Way different texture than the wahoo. And the wahoo is like steak. It's like thick. And the mahi mahi is like really very flaky. So if you ask me which one I like better, I would have to say the ono. The ono is much better with this particular combination of spices. I'm gonna have to bring some to my old man later because some of you probably wonder where he is but we got that boat and he was tired and he was like i need a nap so he crashed he's probably going to be out for like two hours so that's where he is i'm not going to worry about him for right now i'm just going to cook for me well guys thank you so much for hanging out today don't forget to leave a comment down below to be entered into the giveaway and if you guys want to see extra content please consider becoming a member of my channel for the price of a Starbucks coffee, $4.99 a month. You get to see all the extra videos from this trip. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.